The easiest way to use NA10 is through NA10 Cloud, provided by the company itself. It is great, but the price is 24 euro per month. Alternative is to self-host community edition of NA10 on your own server. It has almost the same functionality and will cost you approximately 6 euro per month or maybe even less. And now let's see how to do it with DigitalOcean and Namecheap. So first of all, you should create a DigitalOcean droplet. You go to digitalocean.com, log in with your Google account, account, for example. Then you press create droplet. Droplet is like a server. You need to select your region, Frankfurt here, for example, and then choose an image you choose from the marketplace. And here you find an A10 template. Uh, you choose your option. I choose the cheapest one, six euro per month. And then uh, I will use password and not SSH key. Create a droplet. You can uh, give it a name, create a droplet. And then we are moving to the next section where we would need to have an IP address of this droplet. So if you click on it here, you can see that there is IPv4 IP address and the one, this IP address, you should, you should just copy to the clipboard or write somewhere. Now let's go to the domain name. I will be uh, buying domain on Namecheap. I already bought a domain name, unreasonable.org. I go to manage this domain name and here I just need to do one thing, just create an A record to point to this droplet. So I come here and I choose add new record. It's A record. Here we indicate subdomain. For me, it's going to be automate.unreasonable.ai and IP address, which we copied from the DigitalOcean droplet. And that's done. Domain name is now pointing to DigitalOcean droplet. Let's now go to DigitalOcean, to the console of DigitalOcean. Here, we should just uh, open the console. And here, you just need to select one thing, the subdomain automate, and then after it, the domain name, unreasonable.org which we registered and your email uh, for the uh, for the uh, SSL certificate. Then it's going to be done. And just like that, you have everything set up and you can go and check whether your NA10 instance is working. You go to the browser and we are making the first login to NA10. So automate.unreasonable.org and we are there. That's the uh, login screen. First time you need to indicate your email, your first name, last name and password. And I want to receive recent uh, security updates. Next. NA10 is ready. Uh, we don't need to provide anything else. Uh, basically, if you want to get additional features, you can indicate your, your uh, email address and activation key will be sent to your domain, uh, to your email address. Just like that, license key is there on the way and everything is working. If you want to update NA10, you should log in once again to, uh, to DigitalOcean console, go to the folder Docker Caddy, then Docker Compose Pool to pull up the latest images, Docker Compose Down and Docker Compose Up minus D. Everything is working and restarted. You restart it and then in a couple of minutes, it will work.